Caroline Garcia versus Daniel Collins, third quarter final for the Miami Open for 2024. Both players have been a surprise to get to this stage. Collins started the tournament off unseeded and will take on the lucky loser Perra in the first round. And after dropping the first set, fight back to win. 3 6 6 1 6 1. In the second round, she take on the 30th seed Potapova. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6 2 6 2. In the third round, she take on Avanesian, who just upset Jabur, the sixth seed, in the previous round. But again, no problem for Collins getting through in straights. 6 1 6 2. In the fourth round, she take on the 19th seed Castella, who had actually been really good this time last year in Miami. But again, no problem for Collins getting through in straights. 6 3 6 2 to advance to the quarterfinal. Garcia into the tournament as the 23rd seed. We'll get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she take on Tomova. And after demolishing her in the first set, Tomova would eventually retire. 6-1-5-2 retirement. In the third round, she'd take on Osaka, who had just taken out Svetolina in a very impressive match in the second round. And after a close first set, Garcia would get through in straights. 7-6-7-5. In the fourth round, she'd take on the number three seed, Goff, who had only lost seven games to this stage. And after winning the first and dropping the second, Garcia would run away with the third. 6-3-1-6-6-2 to advance to the quarterfinal. These two have played three times before, with Collins winning all three matches in straight sets, including a match last year in San Diego in the quarterfinals where Collins demolished Garcia. So if Garcia's going to get a win here, she's really going to have to turn her around and figure out how to combat Collins' aggression. Collins is going to win this one. She just has used that aggression and just do what she's been doing in the last three matches. I mean, she hasn't even been bothered really by Garcia in the last couple of matches. Only one tie break in the six sets that they played. So be aggressive and just do exactly what she did in those previous matches. If Garcia's going to win this one, she needs to bring that variety and also bring that serve. She served so well against Osaka. She didn't serve great against Goff, but it got away with it anyway. She needs to really make sure that she does bring the variety and also be aggressive before Collins can be aggressive. Very fun matchup. Collins has had a really good season and now is starting to get some results to show for it. And Garcia having a bit of a resurgence this week, but I've got to go with Collins in three. That head-to-head -head is so one-sided. And with Garcia having a shoulder problem, I've got to go with Danielle Collins for the confidence and for a three-setter to make the semis. But let me know in the comments below, who do you think is going to make the semifinal?